the year six children, because they're in their last year of primary school, they take on extra responsibility and they go into the Key Stage 1 playground during our lunchtime to look after the little children that have recently started school in year one in reception. They are new to the routine of school and playtime and they take responsibility of making sure the children are happy and enjoying their playtime. We are a rights respecting school, we follow the UNICEF rights of the child and that allows the children to understand that the rules that apply to them, the rights that they have, should also apply to children across the world. It allows us in our playground to talk about the rights of individual children and to talk about how other children have the responsibility to respect those rights and to allow them to experience the world in the same way that they want to experience the world. So what is a rights respecting school, Orla? Um, after, after World War II, the ambassadors are children who are selected from years two to year six. This links with our UNICEF rights respecting school status. Um, the children represent the children in their class. They have regular meetings. They make decisions that affect the school with the guidance of a core teacher. Um, they talk about what charities we'd like to support. They run the charitable events that we do in the school. And they are a high profile member of our school community. We ensure that other children know who they are. They've got badges, they've got special ties. They are significant to our school to help us meet the needs of all the children and make sure the children feel they're valued and their opinions are valued in the school as well. When I was voted for an ambassador, I was very happy and, well, because now we get to help children in need and, like, need to help UNICEF. So we have meetings to discuss um, what we're going to do and we do things like fundraisers. What, what latest project have we done to help children, other children? Well, we, we give fundraising and we, especially this year, we give harvest to Ilford um, refugees. That's fantastic. So we're going to go to the refugee centre. We're going to load my boot up, aren't we? And I'll take some representatives and we'll go to the refugee centre and hopefully that food will be used to help the families. The children who are ambassadors take the responsibility really well. They enjoy the status that they get as being an ambassador, they enjoy the fact that they get some special privileges and they enjoy the fact that they've got the responsibility of both taking messages, passing on messages and acting on behalf of their class which is a really important part of the job.